when I'm hurt and need a friend. I know you're with me till the end. Cause if I ever start to doubt, there's just one thing I need to shout. That you are good, 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 and you love me. You are good, 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 I'm in your heart When I'm hurt and need a friend I know you're with me till the end Cause if I ever start to doubt There's just one thing I need to shout That you are good, good me. Well, you are good, good, good. Yes, it's true. Good, strong, loving, kind, like the love I always find. Hope, help, hero, king, stronger than anything. Wise, bright, perfect, side, closest friend, highest, high, the first, last, middle, in your size. I cannot comprehend. Best of all, you set me free when on the cross you died for me. You're everything in life to me, and this is what I say.
it to come I'm watching, waiting and listening Can't wait to see what you've done And I pray
welcome to Families Connect. Now, this is a little bit different from how we had planned it. Um, it isn't quite what we were expecting. We were hoping to be with lots of you at Overton Grange right now. Um, but we are still really, really delighted that you're able to join us online um, and that we're still able to do this with you, um, even if it isn't quite as we planned. So we've got lots of fun things planned for today. Um, we want everybody to be getting involved. Um, so that's grown-ups as well as children. Um, and today we are going to be looking at the topic of peace. That's so exciting. I'm really excited about what we've got coming up today. But first, I just wanted to kind of share about why we're doing these services. We've called it Families Connect because this isn't just for kids. This is for the entire family to get involved in it together. Basically, we believe um, as a kids ministry that the, if the church and the home can work effectively together, so if the family's red and the church is yellow, together they make orange. Come on! Uh, our kids can get the best opportunities for discipleship. They can get to know Jesus. They can have incredible role models in church and out of church. So this is your opportunity to continue the incredible work we did during lockdown, where Lily Threat led you through some activities as kids and grown-ups together. Um, so yes, we want everyone to be getting involved, get stuck in, and just all be big kids together. Absolutely, absolutely. And on that note, um, on being kids together, I think we should start with the games. Great idea, Lil. Okay, so we have given you, if you have older children, in your little packs that we have sent out to you, so some of you will have had packs that have set, were sent home, um, others of you may have looked at the resources list that were sent out during the week. Um, in that pack, you should have some spaghetti, and a bag of marshmallows. Ooh. What do we want you to do with spaghetti and marshmallows? Well, we want to set you a challenge of building a bridge out of spaghetti and marshmallows. Out of spaghetti and marshmallows, yep. Now, I will say that Hannah and I haven't tried this. No. We don't know how difficult it is. So, um, we are intrigued to see what you can come up with as a family. And um, I must say, if you have little ones, we haven't given you spaghetti and marshmallows um, because we thought that could end in disaster. So, um, but please do still make a bridge together as a family. So you could use bricks, you could use connects, you could use any building materials or toys that you've got at home to build the very best bridge. And do remember, we're missing seeing you in person. So please do take pictures of everything um, that you make in today's session and send them into us. And we'll see them. which family can make the best bridge. Okay, on your marks. Get set, go! Walking through the darkness, pushing through the fear. God, we need your presence. God, we need you here. You are with us, fighting for us. We can lay our worries down. Even when we stand in shadows, we are standing on holy ground. So come and help us to be strong. Be brave, be courageous, be strong, be brave, be courageous. Shadows, we are standing on holy ground. 
to the end. 
for the broken hearted You are the lifter of our head Your love is an endless ocean Never running dry You came for the lost and lonely You are the lover of the weak You are our joy exploding Jesus the one we the lifter of our head your love is an endless ocean never running dry you came for the lost and lonely you are the lover of the weak you are our joy exploding jesus the one we need your light breaks through the night we're coming alive coming alive your let us know send us photos videos it's the next best thing to you being here with us or us being all together at Overton Grange did you find it tricky was it easy did you have any great teamwork <laughs> it probably did better than us probably <laughs> much better than us but the whole idea is that today our activity is all about peace so Lily's going to discuss a little bit more about what peace means for us and we drilled that into you enough, yeah. Yes. Peace. Peace today. We're feeling peaceful. Um, and on that note, um, we're going to watch a video um, once I've finished talking. Um, and it's just, um, it's not very long, um, but hopefully it's going to help us calm down a little bit. Um, we've played some games, we've been moving about around a little bit now. Um, so we're just going to take a couple of minutes just to calm ourselves down, calm our bodies down, calm our minds down, um, and hopefully it will help us to feel quite peaceful. Now, um, as we said, it's Remembrance Sunday today, and um, some of you at 11 o'clock may have done an, a two minute silence. Um, now that is something that we do to um, remember people that lived in the past, um, and remember people that um, have worked really hard um, to bring peace into our world. Um, so we're going to take a couple of minutes now 
to remember those people, to think about peace, um, to think about the fact that God created peace um, and that he loves it um, and he wants us all to get on with each other um, and to be peaceful. So whatever you're doing now, I'd love you just to get yourselves into a nice comfy position. Um, you might want to snuggle down on the sofa or maybe even lie down on the floor um, if that helps you to feel calm because sometimes it can be tricky to stay quiet and still when we're feeling a bit het up. So let's just take a few deep breaths, calm ourselves down, watch the video um, and have a think um, about all of those things. Okay, see you in a minute. Okay guys, welcome back. Um, I hope you enjoyed that video as much as I did. Um, it was really lovely just to take a little bit of time to be calm, to be quiet and to think. And it really did make me think. I absolutely love the video and it's given me the opportunity to have a little bit more thought time about what peace is. So you have now got some family discussion questions. Grown-ups, you can take the lead on this. They'll come up on the screen along with our memory verse. And the memory verse is so lovely. It reminds me of poppies, reminds me of planting, of growing peace. It reminds me that I need to really be intentional about being peaceful. Mm. And we'd love you just to chat as a family about what you think about peace or what Jesus might think about peace, how we may be peaceful, um, and really what peace is for the world, especially at the moment. So take some time together. You may want to draw, you may want to write, you may want to mull with some Play-Doh if you have some, depending on the ages of your kids, and just discuss the family questions that we have got coming up on the screen now. So we'll see you in a little bit. Your love is bigger than my fear You hold me close when the storm appears You are with me to the end Your strength will rise in me again You awaken the song You are faithful all night long So I sing from the rooftop you always fight for me You're the fortress that I run to The rock beneath my feet And I will not be shaken I will not be moved When all around is changing I will trust in you
one who gives me hope when I feel lost and all alone. So let the winds rage all around. I know your truth is solid ground. You awaken the song. You are faithful all night long. Here I sing from the rooftops. You always fight for me. You're the fortress that I run to. The rock beneath my feet, and I will not be shaken. No, I will not be moved. When all around is changing, I will trust in you. something a little bit more practical really we're going to get creative um it's one of my favorite things to do in fact i have had lots of fun um today making these as our little examples of what we would love you to try and recreate um in your packs um if you are a little person you should have everything you need to make this so it's a poppy in case you couldn't tell um, and a poppy as Hannah and I are wearing today. Um, it's a symbol that we use a lot for Remembrance Sunday, um, and it's something that we would like you to make just to remind you um, of peace, to remind you of, of that topic and what we've been talking about today. So if you're a little person, you should have a couple of cupcake cases that you can stick on your lollipop stick, and then you can draw your little black middle there. If you are an older child, then you should have everything you need to make one of these. That looks which, great. Yeah. Uh, thank you. I, did, I had loads of fun <laughs> making it. It was actually a very calm and peaceful experience for me making these. Um, so you've got the, you can add the little leaves to the outside and then you've got your button for the centre there. Um, and 
As with everything, we would love to see how you get on making these. Um, some slides are going to come up with some kind of step-by-step -step photos for you to have a go at that. Okay, on your marks, get set, go! God, let's go deeper. It's been a lovely day, such a lovely day, and I thank you for being with me. It's been a lovely day, such a lovely day, and I thank you for being with me. You're so big, you can take care of everything. You're so you by surprise and you love each of us and we love you back on every kind of day on every kind of day i will thank you for walking with me and on the hardest days on the hardest days i'll remember you are with me you're so big you can take care of everything you're so wise nothing ever takes you by surprise and you love each of us and we love you back Such a lovely day, and I thank you for being with me. Um, so 
sorry if that's not quite enough time for you. Um, you can always carry on with those a little bit later. Um, but whatever it is that you've created, um, however you've made your copies, we would love to see them. So please do um, send them in to us. Um, and of course, if you don't have cupcake cases um, or lollipop sticks in your house, um, you can get creative. You can make a poppy out of anything that you've got lying around at home. And we'd love to see it if you've done your own thing or if you've done what we've provided. We'd just love to see the variety from you all. So we are going to now use our poppies that we've made to help us with some prayer activities. Now, you will find a paper plate in your bag and you can either choose to cut the very centre of your paper plate out so you just have a ring around the edge. It needs to be a complete ring, complete circle, or you can choose to keep them in lid, whatever, it's up to you. If you choose to keep the centre in, maybe you could write a memory verse on it and it will come up on the slides if you haven't yet memorised it. But what we'd love to do is create a poppy wreath, which means that you can stick your poppies round the edge of your plate and create a lovely wreath for you to look at and to you as a rem remembrance about peace. Now, wreaths are used at Christmas time, you might see them on people's front doors in autumn, but they also are used during Remembrance Sunday where there are lots and lots of beautiful poppies and they're laid in places where they are seen by lots of members of the public um, on monuments or places of importance and the Queen even lays one. And it's to remind everybody about the day, about what's happened. So we'd love you to use your wreath as a remembrance about peace. Now, we're going to use this to help us do some chat and catch. We're going to pray. So remember that we can chat to Jesus and we can catch back what he gives to us. He loves chatting to us and he loves it even more when we chat to him. So grown-ups, if you leave this with your kids, you can do it out loud, you can do it quietly, you can lay down, you can get active, whatever works best for your kids and your family. We'd love you to look at the chat and catch ideas that we're going to put on the screen. And remember, when Jesus talks to us, he does it in so many different ways. You may feel it in your body, so you may hear something in your head, you may see a picture, you may just feel really peaceful. So use the ideas that you've got on the screen and we'll come back to you in a little while.
chatting with Jesus and trust that the presence of God is just filling your homes right now. Lily, that is all we have time for today. Um, it's gone very quickly. Super quick. <laughs> um, and I hope that even though it's not quite what we had planned or quite what we had expected this week to be like, um, that you still were able to get something um, and connect together as a family um, this afternoon. Couple of things just before um, we leave you. Tickets for ne our next Families Connect service, which is in two weeks' time, um, will be available tomorrow morning. Yes. Now, this one will also be online. We won't be able to meet in Overton again, unfortunately. Um, but we would still love you to sign up so that we can get bags of resources out to you. And the great news is that because we don't have any space limitation at all, because you'll be in your own homes, um, there will be no limit on the number oh! of tickets. So um, any of you watching at home, please do sign up from 9am tomorrow morning um, and make sure you've signed up by Friday at the latest so that we can get all of the resources together for next time and get those delivered to you. And we would love as many of you as possible to join us virtually next time for Families Connect. And because we don't want to leave you with nothing to do next week, um, we will be sending out um, some more activities about peace um, later on in the week for you to have a go at, um, maybe fill some more of your time if you've got some more time over lockdown, um, and just things to keep you busy, keep you thinking about peace, and keep you thinking about God. So until next time, bye. Bye. Guys. Bye. -bye.
feel lost and in the dark I know I'm in your heart When I'm hurt and need a friend Cause if I ever start to doubt There's just one thing I need to shout That you are good, 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 good And you love me You are good Size I cannot comprehend. 